Okay, thank you for your testimony. Next is fire is uh, Dennis Gonzalez in opposition. Good evening. Um, my name is Dennis Gonzalez. So I was part of the team that developed the virus resistant transgenic papaya. I strongly oppose Bill 113. Uh, contrary to what some people say that Hawaii <laughs> Island is the last island that could, could be GM, GMO free, Hawaii Island grows more than 90% of the approved GMO crops that are grown in the state of Hawaii. The transgenic papaya is safe for the environment and the consumption, despite what people say in three minute sound bites. Our data has been published with no credible challenge. Cross pollination ruining non GMO farmers is a big point of Bill 113. I have yet to see results where a certified organic papaya farmer lost his certification due to cross pollination by transgenic papaya. Finally, you know, the intent of Bill 113 reminds me of the words and moral of a song called One Tin Soldier. In this song, an army wanted to take away something that some people had and destroy them in the process. One might say to take away the tools that innocent farmers are using to make a living on Hawaii Island. The chorus goes as such. Go ahead and, go ahead and hate your neighbors. Go ahead and cheat a friend. Do it in the name of heaven, justify it in the end. There won't be any trumpets blowing come the judgment day on a bloody morning after one tin soldier rides away. This bill is like the tin soldier threatening to ruin Big Island farmers and ranchers by taking away their tools. But I predict the Big Island farmers and ranchers will not sit back. They will fight and will overcome this bill. Okay, thank you, Mr. Gonzalez. We have time for probably one or two more testifiers. Why don't we transition? Uh, Kona is done.